Hey everybody, welcome back to What If. So in this What If, I, um, I'm actually very happy this is a What If because this idea is really unique. That is, what if every DC character won in CBB? Um, I I really like the idea mainly because ev- it's funny because every single DC character inside CBB literally lost. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, it sets up a cool what if idea that if every single one won, how would it change, you know, how it went? Because there's a lot of reasons why a lot of characters won in, in CBB, like Patrick, um, Pennywise, all of them, uh, have different matchup simulations. So now that these characters of one, how would it change it? That's just, I, I, it's cool in my, my opinion. <clears throat> so, let's just set this start. Let's just get started. Oh, okay. Start off with round two. We have SpongeBob versus Batman. Now, originally, I was going to pick SpongeBob because, like, you know, SpongeBob is kind of gangster. I'm not going to cap like that. But Batman is also kind of gangster. So, as I'm thinking about it now, I think they both would up, would put up a good fight into this matchup, but I'm just going to be completely honest here. I think the winner would probably be Batman. He's highly underrated, in my opinion, for the CBB stuff. So, yeah, there's that. And I feel like giving at a right potential, I think he could have a really unique and really cool beatbox. So, yep. We have Groot versus Deadshot, which I don't think I need to explain that much on this one. I mean, um, I think they just, you know, both kind of gangster. So, yeah, that's all I got to give it, though. So, they're name him. Patrick versus Darkseid, which is like the only matchup I think will stay. I guess I I guess the same. I mean, I guess. But thing is, uh, I'm I'm I have to say Patrick. It's not. I would prefer Darkseid winning this, but Patrick is just you know just it's Patrick. I I can't really do anything about that. And we have Joker versus Sonic, which, like SpongeBob versus Batman, I think this would be really close and really a unique matchup idea. Like, I'm not even joking. I would pay money for this to be a CBB matchup. But, you know, this is pretty cool. I think Sonic would be the winner, though, because, I mean, Sonic's really liked, so it would make sense for him to be the winner. And, yeah, pretty, as easy as that. Then we got Batman versus Patrick, and, I mean... You know, I think the same thing would happen as for what Deadpool had because Batman beat SpongeBob, so Patrick would want to get back. Yeah, I hate my life. All right, so we have Patrick in the final round. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. And now we have Deadshot versus Sonic. <clears throat> really cool matchup, but I'm just going to be honest here. If Sonic can be Joker, then I'm pretty sure he can be Deadshot. It's just, it's just a fat. And now we have Patrick versus Sonic. By far finishing the series. And the thing is, I think this battle would be close. But I'm going to be honest here. Sonic will probably win this. Mainly for his popularity inside CBB. He's also pretty unique. And he's pretty... He, like, he has like um a really interesting voice. Compared to Patrick being very slow. And kind of dumb. Yep. Lose around time. Mickey Mouse versus Black Panther. I think this battle would be pretty unique and cool, but I'm going to have to pick Black Panther, bro. He's, he's just that gangster. He's the gangster of them all. I'm not going to lie. We I mean, have Pikachu versus Deadpool. The reason why I like this matchup a lot is because they're both voiced by Ryan Reynolds. So it, it I think it just sets up a lot of cool things, but that's all I got to give it to because there's no way Pikachu's winning that. And we have Goofy the Goobert versus Thanos, the... Venus. All right, I think um they would both put up a good fight, but I hate when people say Goofy just wins all the loser round because, he, like a lot of people are saying he's the new Patrick of loser round, which I find crazy. But <clears throat> you know what they say. Pinocchio versus Mario, which I'm not gonna lie, this is by far probably gonna gonna be one of the closest loser rounds in the series. I think Mario puts up a better fight in a way where he has more to do than Pennywise does. Sure, Pennywise can, you know, possess the average, you know, toad or whatever and do whatever. Um, but it's just Mario has so much more to do. Like, he could do pretty much every single power-up, and he would still have more to do in the next rounds. So, I'm going to have to give Mario for that exact reason. Then we have Black Panther versus Thanos. By far, a really cool battle because, you know, Thanos would be rushing him like, 
I beat you in Infinity War, and, and then Black Panther's gonna be like, I beat you in Endgame, you know what I mean? But I think this would be a pretty cool battle, but I think Black Panther's gonna win this. He's by far a lot more, I would say, better in that way. Also, I feel it could be super cool to see this battle in just general. I, I would love to see that. Deadpool versus Mario, which, uh, I'm not gonna lie, this would also be very close. Like I said before, with Mario, he has so much to do, so it's not like he can't run about things to do. Um, Deadpool, on the other hand, he's kind of gangster. No cap. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying this. I, I, it's not 2020, but yeah, I'm going to have to give it to Deadpool. And finishing off the series with loser round final, Black Panther versus Deadpool, which sadly this is a kind of a cuff ending because Black Panther already has lost to Deadpool. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment down more ideas. Because these ideas just, they keep getting better and better. I, I, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I, I like them. <clears throat> and yeah, please like, subscribe, do the goofiest of dances. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time.